What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Queen of Everything, baby. And welcome back to Breezy's World, you guys. And if you're new, guess what? You're not going to want to leave. Just like a kid at Disney World. Okay, before I get into this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And make sure you hit that bell so you can get notified when your girl post a new video. Okay, you guys, so today is the first day of me about to get ready to use my Honey Pot collection. This is my first time ever buying anything Honey Pot. All I hear is Honey Pot this, Honey Pot that, Honey Pot, Honey Pot, Honey Pot, Honey Pot. Honey pot. So I'm like, okay, let me see what this Honey Pot got going on, okay? So as you know, I am a sensitive type person so i got the honey pot sensitive foam and wash i got the unscented dual pack tampons and this one comes with nine regular and nine um super so yeah i was very indecisive about that like should i just get the super or should i get like the unscented so then i got some honey pot sensitive wipes. So yeah, I can't wait to use those. And I also got the honey pot organic super herbal infused pads with wings. It says fragrance free. So we gonna see. We gonna see. So yeah, you guys, I'm about to shower and use my sensitive and then i don't i don't i mean i use these throughout the day i've been hearing like mixed reviews about the honey pot like i heard that they're good that they burn the wipes burn and the foaming wash bar it had your teapot hot and everything so i mean i just hope that is not the case for me or the case for any of you guys if you use honey pot let me know and let me know what you experience because i'm a little scared you know i'm i'm already sensitive so i don't need nothing messing up down there you feel me girls like nothing <laughs> So yeah, I'm a little, you know, scared, but I just really wanted to give these a try and I wanted to tell you guys, like, if it worked for me, is it worth the money? Um, oh, the money, speaking of the money, y'all, I forgot how much it was to tell you guys. Okay, I put all that in the description down below. I did get, um, I got these two from... I got these two from Target and then I got these two from Walmart. Walmart did not have like a whole little section or whatnot and Target had, you know, Target gonna always have the A game look. But yeah, you know, so Target had like, you know, more than Walmart did. But as me being sensitive, I just went with the unscented pads, I mean the unscented tampons, the unscented body wash, the unscented everything, okay? So, hey, let me stop talking and let me get myself together and I just wanted to get on here and tell you guys and I'll be back later on tonight so I can give you guys an update. Okay, that's another thing, ladies. So, if you haven't watched my L Organic, um, review and period talk. Okay, let's, let's talk about it. Period talk, one on one. <sighs> period talk, one on one. I hate being on my cycle. If you don't notice, then now you know. I hate being on my cycle. The cramps are super duper bad, and that organic. Tampons and pads are supposed to help with cramps. I think a lot of people say that it did like calm their cramps down. So that is another reason why I wanted to get this honey pot. But when I tried the L products, I ain't see no difference. You know, so <laughs> I was still like 
cramping really, really bad. The first two days, first two, three days, still hell for me. What I really want to do right now, let me show y'all. I want to see what these pads look like. Because I probably could have just, you know, st stuck to my regular. Because I know the L Organic pads were super thin. And it was like a panty liner for me. So, and then I bleed heavy. No, that was not going to work. Like, no. So, yeah, let's open these. Let's just see. Because I'm sure. Oh, yeah, these y'all. I know focus y'all baked in did i not read these right or something do they not come big like thicker than this y'all okay one second let me show y'all the honey pot and the ill organic pets this is honey pot as you can see, I guess. And this is L. Now let me open this for y'all. I can't do nothing with this. This so this was a waste of money for me. Especially the L ones, because they're ultra thin. So this is the L penny liner. And this is the honey pot. So they both have wings though, but I can't do nothing with these. I cannot. I'd be changing these out every five minutes if I was to wear these. No, I can't do it. I'm telling y'all, like, that's just how heavy I bleed. That'll be a panty liner. So I guess they'll be good for like, you know, the last few days when your cycle going off and you don't bleed as heavy. So I guess that's what those can be used for. Now that I think about it, I guess I can just, you know, use those on the last few days. Because normally what I use is um, always the overnight ones, the purple and the orange ones. So I guess I can start using those because... I cannot let my money go to waste, okay? So, now let's look at the honey pots, tampons. This is what they look like. So, I'm taking the, these are the regular. And these are the super. I'm going to give the super a try as soon as I get out the shower. But, yeah, you guys. So, I will be back with you guys to give y'all an update on what I think about the Honey Pot Collection. If you haven't already, comment down below and let me know your experience with the Honey Pot. I need to know. Y'all give me some feedback, please. So, just stay tuned for the next clip. Your girl will be right back. Okay, you guys, so I just got out the shower and your girl feeling good. I used the, as you seen, I used the Honey Pot Sensitive Foaming Wash, good in my hood. So, um, to be honest, like, I feel real good down now. I used it all over my body and it's doing my skin some justice because half of the time if I use something, and I'm so sensitive, like, as soon as I get out the shower and draw, like, if I start itching or whatever, I know that I cannot use that product. But I haven't had that feeling with this Honey Pot Sensitive. So, that's a good thing. I will continue to use that. So, now I am getting ready to use the Honey Pot Super Tampons. So, um, I'll be back and let me get myself together and I'll give y'all my honest opinion about the tampons throughout the day so what's up you guys okay so i am back and it's been a full day of using the 
honey pot collection that I broke. So as y'all know, I did use the tampons and I had no problems with using the tampons. Now then, when I got done using the tampon, I put on the organic super pads. And listen, I don't know what it was, but it was like I was feeling like a little sensation, like something was about to burn or something. So I was like, um, hmm, I'm not sure about these. I don't know if it's the mint lavender aloe vera in it. You can feel it. Like, you literally can feel it. Like, it didn't, you know, have me scratching and itching or anything. But you can just really feel that or whatever. Like, it's got a little hot or something down there. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I just don't know what was going on with that. I don't think I'm going to use those again, to be honest with you guys. I just didn't like that feeling. Um, but other than that, I have nothing else to say about the honey pots. The tampons, thumbs up. The pads with wings, eh, it's like 50-50. Um, I haven't used the sensitive wipes just yet, but... Um, other than that, I like the body wash, the foaming body wash. I like that. But let me know if you like Honey Pie, if you use Honey Pie, what was your experience? Like, let me know something. Is it supposed to feel like that? Because I'm a little confused <laughs> on what that little sensation is like hot or something, you know? Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And make sure you ring that bell so you can get notified when your girl posts a new video. That's because she's a trade She's so bougie, bougie. Don't never take.